Virginia child care providers, I want to express my sincere gratitude for your commitment and hard work in keeping our children safe in a nurturing environment in these difficult times. We recognize that the public health guidance around group size and social distancing, as well as the increased costs of additional PPE and cleaning and sanitation requirements, make it difficult for you to maintain operations. We appreciate your efforts in keeping our children safe while providing them with a nurturing learning environment. Your selfless dedication to children and families is invaluable to the Commonwealth. We thank you for your commitment and we are proud to serve you here at the Department of Social Services. To help address the financial needs of providers across the Commonwealth, a few weeks ago, the Department of Social Services approved 2,500 grants for a total of $23 million to help providers like you continue to serve families in your communities. We recognize that some of you experience challenges in receiving your payments in a timely fashion, and we appreciate your patience as we work through those issues. We are excited to provide a second round of grants with this federal funding and wanted to let you know that we have partnered with a third party vendor to expedite the payment process. Again, we value the services that you're providing in our communities and we're committed to providing you the support that you need to continue operations. And now for a few details about our new grant program, I'm gonna turn it over to our Director of Licensing, Tara Ragland. Thank you, Commissioner Storen. I join in expressing our appreciation for the work our child care providers continue to do to ensure the safety and well-being of Virginia's children. We tirelessly work on the front lines to provide essential care to families. On behalf of the entire child care licensing team, we thank you. For a few details about the CARES II grant application process. Applications will be accepted until 5 p.m. on August 19th or until funding runs out. Grants will be issued to approved applicants on a first come, first served basis. Providers that received funds for CARES 1 can also submit an application for CARES 2. If your information has not changed, you will not need to provide all that documentation again. Payments will be for July, August, and September, and we'll use the same formula as CARES 1. As Commissioner Storen mentioned, we also have partnered with the Virginia Early Childhood Foundation, who will be assisting us to ensure grant payments are made promptly. For more information, visit our dedicated child care website at www dot childcareva.com. Questions or concerns can be directed to our team at ask for care. That's ask the number four care at DSS dot Virginia spelled out dot gov. We will continue to keep you informed about resources and information available to you. Again, we thank you for the important work you do.